on camera. A big win for police after they arrest two teenagers who they think are behind a string of car break-ins. Good evening and thank you so much for joining us. I'm Tom Haynes. And I'm Sine Simpson. Car break-ins have frustrated police and victims all over Metro Atlanta. But this evening, Peachtree City Police tell us they were able to make several arrests because someone who saw teens pulling on car door handles called 911. And within minutes of that early morning call, officers had stopped a car that they say was loaded with stolen items. Fox 5's Doug Evans joins us live from Fayette County with a closer look at the victims and the body camera video of the arrests. Doug? Tom, I talked to uh, one of the victims who was grateful to have her laptop back that was stolen out of her SUV. You see, it had all of her important information that she needed to file her taxes. Julie Husky checks her SUV to make sure it's locked. It was not the other night, and thieves stole her laptop. No. Nope. Oh, you locked. got it locked. Got it locked. <laughs> the only thing I've got in it today is a thing of trash bags. <laughs> okay. How grateful are you to the Peachtree City Police that they were able to get this solved? Oh, I'm just very grateful. Hopefully um, it won't happen again or we'll just all be more mindful of it. Four in the morning, April 4th, Julie Husky's neighbor spotted two guys pulling on door handles of cars parked in Peachtree City. Police spotted the car leaving a neighborhood and pulled it over. Police would arrest 18-year-old Eric Jernigan and 17-year-old Octavius Wilson. Both are from Stone Mountain. Both teens are charged with breaking into 24 cars that night. Police say the back seat of the car was loaded with things that didn't belong to them. Um, there are several large items to include uh, computers, uh, subwoofer box, some backpacks. Um, they were all confirmed by the victims as being taken from their vehicle. I met a gentleman yesterday that lives across the street in Braylon Green, and he had just moved here from Dothan, Alabama, and he had so much stuff taken out of his vehicle, uh, all related to his work, laptop, phone. Three neighborhoods in Peachtree City were hit, Ridgefield Condominiums, Peachtree Club Condominiums, and the Braylon Court Subdivision. Police say they're now working to identify the owners of all the stolen items. And once we confirm that the items that were taken from their vehicle um, were items that we have in, in uh, our possession, then we can return it back to the rightful owner.